These are the top stories of the week. Google Fiber is expanding. There's an amazing robot you have to see and everything else you need to know. Google Fiber announced it will acquire WebPass. WebPass is a high-speed fiber internet service provider. It does business in five major markets, including Chicago, Boston, and San Francisco. The service is in apartment buildings and businesses. These are two areas that Google Fiber would like to get into. WebPass also uses point-to-point -point wireless to build out its network. Google Fiber has been working on a way to connect wireless towers to its fiber lines. This could be a good match. Twitter's making some changes. It will now allow anyone to upload videos up to 140 seconds long. The old limit was 30 seconds. Twitter is also bringing this change to Vine. Certain users will be able to attach 140 second long videos to Vines. The short six second Vines will remain. You'd have to click through to see the longer videos. Boston Dynamics released a video introducing Spot Mini. It's a smaller version of its Spot robot. That's the one that looks like a dog. The video shows a nimble dog-like creature with an extended neck. Spot Mini can do all kinds of things, like load the dishwasher, recycle your cans, and even slip on banana peels. Don't worry, Spot gets up. The robot can also climb stairs. You might find this terrifying, but I believe it's truly adorable. I want one. Let's go rapid fire, shall we? Opera and Microsoft are in a spat about which browser is best for your laptop battery. Microsoft says Edge is the best. Opera says it's the best. They both agree that Chrome, it's not the best. It's a battery killer. BitTorrent announced a video and music streaming service called BitTorrent Now. Elon Musk says the Tesla Model S can act as a boat for short periods of time, and he doesn't recommend you do that. YouTube will bring live streaming to its mobile app soon. And yes, it was a very slow week, but now you're all caught up in tech. To get your daily dose of tech news, check out CNET.com slash update. For a weekly dose, hit up CNET.com slash radar. I'm Ayaz Akhtar, signing off.